All right, one of the um, more concerning aspects of chronic hypercapnia is acidosis. This is the increase of carbonic acid as you put CO2 into the system. And we know that when the body becomes chronically acidic, it is permissive for cancer. How do we know this? Because we see it in the COPD model that they have higher rates of cancer due to chronic hypercapnia. We've already seen skyrocketing increases in the rates of cancer in our children. Our school is in a very small town, and the whole time I've been there, there have been at least three children at any given time with cancer in a school of 300 children. That alone is not acceptable, and we should be looking at why. And then we're going to mask our children, knowing that if they have cancer, it's going to be very permissive and feed that cancer, knowing that it may be permissive for getting cancer because we are two and a half years out. When are we going to stand up? 